Hello everyone, let's talk about three points in uh, RPG Builder. Three points are what we usually call talent points or progression points or skill points. These are points that you will be able to gain in game based on many different actions or things that you do in game. And you will also be able to spend them both um, in a tree, for example, a combat tree, gathering tree or um, crafting tree. But you will also be able later to use them as a currency. Um, so let's take an example of this one, the mage points that we're looking at right now. This mage point is what I'm currently using in game for the mage class to, um, you know, every time, for example, the mage levels up, he gets one point and this point can be spent in the, in one of the combat trees for the mage. So compare this to, for example, something like World of Warcraft, where you have the mage class and every time your character levels up, you get a point. And this point can be spent in one of the talent trees of your choice. So, um, of course, you can define a name and so on, a description that could be displayed in the UI. But what really matters here is the start amount and the maximum amount. So, start amount, pretty straightforward. If this is zero, your character will start with zero points. If it's above, it's going to start with the specific value. A max amount is not required. If you want to keep it, um, if you don't want any max amount, you can leave this field as zero and it will not be capped out. And then you need to set a tree type. So in this case, it's combat because it's uh, for the match class. And that's pretty much it for the initial general values. Now, that's where things get interesting. We have gain requirements here. And as we can see for the match class, we have a requirement of type class level up meaning that whenever the mage class or whatever class is assigned here, in this case it's mage, but it could be warrior or whatever, uh, but we're going to keep it to mage for now, uh, is gaining a level, you're going to get this amount of points. So in this case one, but you could be five, 500, whatever you want. Um, so that's pretty cool. That's a pretty neat um, requirement. And just by doing that, it's actually working out of the box in game. You just uh, gain a level and automatically you will get one of those points. Now you can have as many gain requirements as you want per uh, three points and they have different types. So another one is skill level up. In this case, as you can imagine, it's exactly the same as a mage. Uh, I mean, as a class level up, but uh, you have to assign a skill. We can also require to kill a specific NPC. So for example, if I would kill a fire elemental, I could get one point. A bit later, I'm going to make it possible to uh, decide how many of this specific NPC should be killed because as of right now, it's every time you kill one, which is not um, optimal. But just to give you a cool design idea, um, this NPC killed field could be used um, if in your game you have many bosses and you would want uh, your characters or your players to gain points every time they kill a boss. And for example, those boss points could be spent in a very, very strong uh, combat tree. Uh, so this will unlock very powerful abilities, but you would have to kill those bosses to unlock them, right? Or even uh, something else, um, those boss points could be used as a currency. So you have to kill those boss, get this currency, and with this currency, you can buy some very powerful weapons or whatever. And the last uh, gain requirement is item gain. So in this case, every time we could, we would, you know, get in our bag a trainee staff, well, one, or it could be five or whatever, but in this case, let's keep it to one, we will get one point, for example. So that's pretty cool. And uh, that's not something we're going to be using right now, but I just wanted to uh, show you that. So that's pretty much it for the three point system. This will let you define all kind of points type and, um, how they should be gained and stuff like that. So thank you for watching. I hope you like how this works. And the next video is going to be about um, combat trees. So we can actually see how we spend those points, right? So make sure to subscribe if you want more videos like that. Join the Discord to talk with us. And see you in the next video.